So we're here with uh, U-Blocks. So who are you? I'm Pelle Svensson from the short range team in Sweden. And here we are demonstrating an IoT gateway functionality. We have a Bluetooth low energy module inside the dice. Actually five of them. So this is BTLE? Yes. Uh, is it ARM? This is not ARM. But in the gateway, we're using ARM embed. So here we have a multi-radio module running Bluetooth and Wi-Fi and a Cortex M4. And we're running an embed-enabled uh, IoT gateway application inside. What is this? This is a dev board for this embed. So uh, what does U-Blocks do? We are a company based in Switzerland. We do three things. Uh, positioning devices like GPS. We do cellular like 2G and 3G mod modules and, and also LTE. And the third leg is where I represent the short range. We do Bluetooth and Wi-Fi modules. All right. So there's all these uh, this are demonstrations this is, this of your... Is, this is the whole package. So what, what do you call those? Modules? What do you call those? Those are modules and those are chip. Right. Uh, so let's see this demo. How, how does it work? When I move them, the BLE connection is established. And when I throw the dice, it will be connected to uh, this uh, IoT gateway and then sent up to the cloud. And then it's going to be presented on a web browser. Nice. So how does that work? Uh, it knows which side it's on? It's like yes. accelerometer? There's an it? accelerometer on this BLE module. And once the dice stops rotating, the gateway application will calculate what is the number that is being displayed. And that value is sent up to the cloud server and then presented uh, through the web into a browser. So you're a Swiss company? Swiss-based right? company. So how big is uh, U-Blocks? So who's using U-Blocks? We have a lot of customers uh, in automotive. So for position and navigation and also fleet management, we do a lot of business in uh, in that area, we also do industrial uh, customer uh, sales into medical and uh, control system, as well as we do some into consumer. So we have our uh, positioning devices and some of our some of the wearables like watches and so on. So, what do you think about ARM embed? It's an uh, interesting uh, architecture for uh, allowing our customers to embed their application into a microcontroller that is already in our module. And we don't use all the resources, so we can open up that for our customers to use as well. All right. And Embed uh, Arm has made a, a good architecture for that with, with security, with the standardized APIs and so on. So we think this is a very good future for modules like that. And it's just starting, right? It's the it's beginning, and uh, now there's Arm, Arm V8-M. A bunch of new stuff's going to happen, right? Yeah, I think that's going to happen a lot. And I see on the show there's a lot of companies here, there's a lot of attendees as well. So I think the interest for this combination is very good.